Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil 2, where we last left off. We were playing as Leon, of course. Yes, I remember these things. And we had just got to the sewers. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I've got to remember where the hell I was going. Ah, right. I'm guessing we're going to jump down there into the muck. Lovely. What do we have weapon-wise and equipment-wise and all that good stuff? We've got a shotgun, plenty of shells. Actually, not doing too bad with the hanger ammo either. All right. Let's go. Boop. And where does this take us? And I have a husky running around as well. But he should be fine. That's a pleasant smell. Yeah, it smells delicious, Leon. Smells like victory. Alright. Oh, we actually... Ah, that's where Leon turns up. Alright, that's cool. Now, do we have any G-monsters down here? The answer, probably. But whether we're going to find any now... I don't know. There's something about. So Leon does enter this place from a different angle. Okay, that makes sense. You alright there, boys? You just roasted and toasted? Oh, hello. Yeah, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Come to Papa Leon. Oh, yeah, we lost our infinite knife as well, didn't we? God damn it. Come on, buddy. There we go. That ended your problem, didn't it? Now, what else have we got around here? There is stuff here. That we need the key for. Same as in the original. Definitely. Ah, there's a Z there. This guy's probably going to get back up too. Well, he's not going to get up now, but he probably would have. Oh, hello, buddy. I didn't see you there. Nice to meet your acquaintance. I'm Leon, and you're dead. Ah, oh, hey, buddy. You're going to come this way. Ah, oh, that's locked from the other side. That we need. He we don't need. I love that blood splatter sound when they're dying. It's so good. Let's switch back up to the uh, 45. Ah, brilliant. Just what I actually wanted. Definitely like having me the 45 and a knife. Nothing worse than not having a damn knife to defend yourself. Spear, buddy, no, back. You can't go climbing over me and all of my equipment. I mean, you can. So we do need that. But I don't think we need that yet. We should probably we should go down here first. That's it. You've got to sit down and settle now. Hopefully. We've only had him for about a week. He's uh, still getting used to everything. And he has come from uh, two disruptive families. So. Oh, nice. Only two cartridges, but I'd rather have two new cartridges than none. Alright. So for Leon, then. Can't go through there. So what way does Leon go? That's the question. I'm guessing. I'm guessing. He has to go this way. Are you going to get up, sir? No. 
Yeah, surely he has to go this way then. But that doesn't lead anywhere though. There's nothing down there. I mean, we've got that. But all that does is move this bridge. And that's not really much use to us. Although, we do have the super fun happy slide. Which just takes us back down there, I think. I don't think this walkway actually goes anywhere. This is garbage. Can you tell I haven't played this in ages? Yeah, super fun. Oh no, super fun happy slide. Leads us down here. Ah, here we are. This is where we wanted to be. And we have our first G monster. Well. At least we had our first G-Monster, but he seems to have, you know, up and fucked off. Which is fine. Uh, let's grab that. Gonna want to make some more shells. He's still there. You know, we could fight this guy. We could. Or... And because I picked up my knife, I had the wrong thing selected. How did he double grab us? How did he double grab us? Okay, not sure how that happened. Alright, let's get up here. I want to kill this guy. Because now... He has. Come on, Leon. Get up. You hit me. You actually hit me. Right. Are you not dead yet? Nope, you're not dead yet. Come on, get up, you bastard. There we go. Now, Leon, up. There we are. There we are. Uh. Come on, let's kill this guy because I want my knife back. I want my knife back. Oi, matey! Where are you? Oi! Did we kill you? Well, that was a waste of time. You despawned, I guess. I hate it when they do that. Never mind. I'm sure he's going to, like, turn up later. God damn it. Cable car. Mm, that was a huge waste of time. He, like, dumped all of our ammo into him. For no reason. Because he despawned. I haven't seen them disappear like that. Right, there shouldn't be any enemies in here. With, uh, Leon. Yeah, we've got some still boys. Want those. Where'd she go? Oh, of course, this is the same. This one is S Z G F. Yeah. I remember. Oh, we've got some Magnum ammo. Not bad. Actually, you know, I wonder if the Magnum would be good against these guys. Probably. But I'm not sure I really want to waste magnum shells on G-monsters. Or G-mutants. I don't like the sound of that. William! Come on. Ada. There's Ada. I think she's alright. She looks fine. I'm yeah, yeah, we're on the way, Ada. Maybe. Uh, there's a map there. 
Map is good. What else do we have? Spear, buddy. Oi, oi. Don't go that way. There's too much gear over there, bud. Right, now there's nothing that way that we can do. Let's jiggle around with our inventory. We have the ability to make some more shotgun shells. We've got a lot of magnum rounds. Let's store those for now. Let's... You know what, let's just make some shells. That's pretty much all we're going to be using around here. Almost made magnum ammo. I definitely prefer the shotgun over the magnum. Like, the shotgun's just such a versatile tool. Because we can use the bloody thing for everything. It's great against zombies. It's not bad against bosses. This acting is really bad. Oh, please. Stop. No, don't hurt him. I love how useless those uh, umbrella goons actually are. They did, Leon. I can see how nothing gets past you, buddy. Yeah, pretty sure the handgun is just obsolete now. Let's get rid of it. And whilst we're getting rid of things... Let's put the grenade down. Oh, we've got like three of them. Let's take the grenade then. Yeah, let's take the grenades. Uh, we've used that discard. And let's... Eat a herb. Cool. Right. Um, good to go. I guess really we could have taken the magnum as well, but like, honestly, I don't think there's any like value in using the magnum yet. To be honest. Because we don't get a lot of ammo for it. I mean, I know we can make ammo. Um, but I don't even know how much ammo we get, to be honest. Might be worth experimenting. Not that we can now. But, you know. Oh, another Claire's note. Leon, I have to take a little detour to help this girl I found. If you don't, If I don't save her, I hate to imagine what might happen. You go on ahead. You've, you're almost out of the city now. Don't worry about me. I'll make it out, I promise. Ooh. I don't know if I got that note last time. Oh, there we go. I guess I didn't. Now we've read all of the files in the game. Only 5% of players have got that. I kept thinking, what possible note have I missed? But there we are. Jobs are good. The lore and the notes in this game were very good. I won't say they're better than the original, because in the original they were excellent, but they were just as good, I think. So this one is left to right 12. Left, oh god. Left to right 12, left 8. I think this one gives us something pretty tasty. Yeah, it's a shotgun upgrade. Shotgun stock. Now, what does the shotgun stock actually do? Allowing the gun to be fired and reloaded in one smooth action. So it fires and reloads faster. Doesn't make too much sense, but sure, fine. Whatever. But it does, of course, make it look cool. We like our guns and our Resident Evil games to look cool. Hey, zombies! Didn't think I forgot about you guys, did you? Oh, no, I missed that shot. Not happy with that. No matter. Need to take this guy out as well, otherwise he will be a problem later on. 
Okay. You mean that? Why are you telling me how to combine items game? This is like technically my sixth playthrough of this game. <clears throat> And we're like halfway through a playthrough as well. So, you know. Pretty sure if I don't know how to combine items by now, I'm never going to learn. Like, it is above my mental capacity to learn. Now, I'm not saying I'm the smartest guy in the shed. I'm not saying I'm the smartest guy in the shed. The sharpest tool. Uh, in the in the sharpest tool. God's sakes, man! Honestly, uh, I'm not saying I am the sharpest knife in the drawer, but even I know how to combine items sometimes. Right, here we are, in my favourite part of the game. Not really. Not a huge fan of this part of the game. Actually, that's not true. I quite like this part. We're going to pop that zombie, because he could be problematic if we let him. Now, this is where we have to fight all the G-monsters. Hey, buddy. I hope you're hungry. Have a snack. Yep. Boom, bud. Boom. We're not going to fight these guys. This is why we've been saving up all our nades. Pretty much. Move it, Leon. Move it. There we go. Oh boy. Run. Yeah, we don't want to fight these guys because they are just a colossal ammo sink. And you really don't have to fight them either. So, you know. Oh yeah, I always I always like instinctively come down here because of the raccoon, but I've destroyed the raccoon, so it's fine. I destroyed him like years ago. We will grab that though. All right. Now remember how long like I was stuck on this puzzle to start with. I say puzzles. Well, <coughs> it, I mean it is a puzzle, obviously, and it's quite a hard puzzle. Um, the first time you play it, I guess. But once you know what you're doing, it's not that bad. Now, I don't really want, want to go back to the uh, police station. But, like, if I was playing it by myself, I probably wouldn't. But in the interest of not leaving anything out, I think we will. And can I just say how much the shotgun head splodge uh, ability actually improves with the upgrades. I mean, I know. We're making it more powerful. But uh, it really does get better. Where do we... There it is. Uh, I want to leave that one there for now. Because we want us to flamethrower. Because we like... Yeah, I know how to use the flamethrower game. We like the flamethrower. I guess we might as well unlock that as well. I mean, there's no real reason to, I don't think. But we will. Yank. And we'll go down here now. And that is the queen. Put the queen in the slot to open the door. I can't believe how hard I found this to begin with. I mean, it's... Well, I suppose you could say the same about just about any puzzle. 
Everything's easy when you know what to do. Yeah, right, boy. You're a good wolf. You're a good wolf. You're having a bit of a yawn. I can't give you fuss. Uh oh. Spear, come here, buddy. Spear, no, come on. Um, I think. Okay, I have. Um. Yeah, I don't know if you see this, guys, but I now have a wolf on me. Oh God. Well, <laughs> this is undignified, Spear. Um, send help, I guess. Spear, you weigh like forty-five kilos. Oh God. Can I play my game now, please, buddy? Oh, Jesus. You can sit next to me, like that, like a good doggo. But you can't sit on me, buddy. All right? I know you've only been here a week. <laughs> oh, I wonder if I can get him in there. There we go. He's just like chilling out next to me. Ah, spear. You good doggo. You're going to watch me slay some beasties. <sighs> okay. Right, now, where were we before I was interrupted by a wolf? We were getting out of here, weren't we, Spear? Go on, buddy. Let's go. Now, these... How many nades have we got left? We've got three. we got enough to get through this. I think we're going to be fine, bud. Going to be just fine, Spear. Honestly. <laughs> You're the happiest dog on the planet, aren't you? Oh. Hello. Now. I think we have... There's one over there. They actually are quite horrific, the sounds that they make. Alright, you're gonna grab me. No, you're not. You stupid bastard. You could have been fed a grenade. But no. No, you did not want a grenade. Which is fine. I didn't really want to give you one, to be honest. I don't like giving my grenades away for free. Come on, you. You can have one. Bon appetit, motherfucker. Boom! How do you like that? You like that? If you come near me again, buddy, you can have another. Right. Now, let's go up here. Yeah, I remember thinking that when I first played... Oh, yeah, there's Smash from the side. I remember when I first came uh, to this bit as Claire. Have you knocked... You have knocked my drink over. Yeah. Good thing there ain't a lot in it. You almost spilt my drink. Don't get a wolf, guys. Cats are bad enough. Right, um, okay. Hmm. There we go, that's more like it. I'm glad I opened this bit up, to be honest. Glad I came this way. Yeah, all these guys would be up here. Well, be awake now if we didn't um, do this. So, actually, we could go to the work lift now. And we should, if we're quick, be able to outrun this guy. Run, Leon! Run! 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 Yeah, we can outrun him. Kiss my fucking ass, pal. What do we say, Spear? What do we say, buddy? What do we say to the monsters? What do we say? Repeat it with me, buddy. Fuck them. Right, let's go. Ooh, hello, bird. Yeah. 
Don't want you getting up and biting me in the buns. Alright. Oh, I get some good bullets here, I suppose. Now, now we can use our key. And we can go back. That's basically, in a nutshell, how quick and easy the uh, sewer is in this game. And we can make mad stacks of shotgun shells here. I say mad stacks of shotgun shells. It's not really mad stacks. I mean, there's a few. Now, as Leon is our mutual best friend gonna be upstairs? I'm not sure. I hope he's not upstairs. Are you having a sneeze, buddy? You coming down with a touch of the T-virus? Or G-virus, really? Yep, we're empty. Let's get out of here. Right, let's rock and or roll. Now, I said incorrectly that this was Claire's way up. Oh. I don't leave those puppies there. Yeah, that this is Claire's way up. Of course it isn't. Both of them come back this way. I, for some reason, forgot about that. Hey, I never said I was MLG at this game, damn it. Not yet, anyway. I don't know if I'm going to play it after I finish this LP. Unless, uh, I mean, that's some, obviously I will play it in the future. At some point. Because um, this game really is that good. But I don't know if I will keep striving to improve. Maybe. I'm not sure. I would like to get S ranks. Oh yeah, because I've got to do the hardcore run as well. Should I record the hardcore run? Uh, I don't really know, to be honest. Maybe. Right, okay. Oh, that's already open. Sweet. Um, we will keep that on us then. We will ditch that. So all we have left to do here, if memory serves, is the two hiding places. Yeah. But unfortunately, to open the hiding places, we do have to go get this roll of film developed. Hmm. I thought there was still a liquor in this room. That's actually kind of annoying. So that's going to slow us down here. But no matter. Um, use that. Hiding places. Now. So there's one in the stars room. Which we can get to up here. I don't know if the liquor can get us upstairs. And it sounds like there's another one around here. Or is that because he's downstairs? I'm not sure. I don't know enough about this, to be honest. Now, is there a liquor here again? Because we're returning. I'm going to say probably not. Now, what does Leon get here, then? I know what he gets downstairs. I remember that much. He gets ammo for the flamethrower. But what does he get here? Ah, oh, he gets a sight for the lightning hawk. 
for fast aiming. Is that worth it? Um, I don't know. I would say... I would say the flamethrower ammo is worth it because the flamethrower is fucking awesome. Is it as good as... Is it as good as the, uh... Spark shot? Yeah. I would prefer it to the spark shot. But then, I... S I was gonna say, you should really compare the flamethrower to the SMG, but that's not true. You should compare the SMG to the lightning hawk. Now, as I've said before, I don't have... a lot of experience with the lightning hawk. Which is obviously going to change in this playthrough. But the SMG is actually way better than a lot of people are giving it credit for. It's not like super powerful if you take it at face value. But it is monstrous. At killing uh, bosses. Wow, it's monstrous at killing Birkin anyway. And yeah, we get some flame. Oh, it's a full tank of 400 fuel. That's nice. Um, yeah, it's monstrous at killing Birkin. And it's really good at removing zombies and stunning zombies. And on top of that, it gets the silencer. So it's silent. Um... Well, suppressor, really. Yes, it's, it's, it's very much a silencer in game logic wise. Not very realistic, but hey ho. Uh, let's upgrade the. Uh, Lightning Hawk. Yeah, I do love how suppressors make guns absolutely silent in, in video games, which is totally inaccurate. Uh, makes them quieter, but a suppressed gun, even with uh, subsonic ammo, is still loud. Spare, what are you doing, buddy? He's just like rolling around on the floor. Uh, it's still very loud because the action of the gun makes an incredible amount of sound on its own. Um, I'm thinking, I know it's dangerous. I know you only tell me. Should we got 18 magnum rounds plus the seven? So we've got 26 magnum rounds. How have we got 26? If we've got seven plus 18, that's not 26. Right, we have. Yeah, we could take that, I suppose. Just in case. Large caliber handgun bullets. How long have we been recording for? Oh, 32 minutes. We better call it there, actually, guys. So, thank you very much for watching. When we come back, we're going to go back down. And we're going to go through... Yeah, we're done. Wow, we're actually done with that now. We're going to go back downstairs uh, into the sewers and continue through the chest door. So, thanks for watching, guys. As always, till next time.